Today we're covering a topic that really everyone can relate to. I'm going to share with you the secret to overcoming anxiety in your life. It actually comes from the Bible in the book of Philippians chapter 4. It says there, and Paul's writing this, Don't worry about anything. Instead, pray about everything. Tell God what you need and thank him for all that he's done. And then you'll experience this peace that passes all understanding. So let's break this down. I see four really important secrets. And you can make a habit of these things. First of all, he says, don't worry about anything. So the first tip is just to choose not to worry. I don't know if you've thought about worry that way, but it really is a choice. Just like any other choice that you make, worry is something that you decide to do. So if you can decide to worry, then you can decide not to worry. That's the first secret. Now, Paul also says pray about everything. So that leads to the second secret. Pray about it. I don't know if you feel like you're a spiritual person or not, But the great thing about God is anyone can pray to him. So pray. Pray about the thing that you're anxious about. Next time you feel anxiety, let it serve as a trigger for your prayer. He goes on and he says, tell God what you need. And so the third secret is to verbalize your needs to God. You probably complain about your needs or gossip about them to everyone else in your life. Have you ever thought about verbalizing your needs? To God? That's what the secret is. Paul says that if you tell God what you need, then he'll listen to you. So learn to verbalize what you need. Learn to put it out there in prayer. You know, the first couple times you do it might be hard, but you might get really good at it. And the fourth thing is, Paul says to thank God for all that he's done. And so the last secret is to thank God for the wins in your life. And you do have wins, don't forget it. Make a list of all of the things that God has done for you. I know that it can be really easy to be overwhelmed by anxiety and to look at all of the negative things that you're worried about. Well, put that on one list. But this other list, the win list, is more important. Make a habit of telling God thank you for all of the things that are going right in your life. This is a habit that can set you free. And look at what Paul says will happen if you practice these four things. He says, then you'll experience God's peace, which exceeds anything we can understand. His peace will guard your hearts and minds as you live in Christ Jesus. So what a benefit to learning these four practical habits, these four secrets of overcoming anxiety in your life. 